Fresh Focus Sports. Let's get it. Thank you for watching Fresh Focus Sports original content. Please subscribe in the bottom right corner of the video screen. Every Monday, Wednesday, Friday at 6 o'clock a.m., we doing skills training. We only want to produce pros, and if you want to be a pro, then you got to spend a certain amount of time in the gym. And you got to get used to being uncomfortable, and you got to be able to sacrifice. You know, basketball has grown so much now. You got kids all over the world that want to come to the United States and play at the highest level, so. Ain't no excuses, man. Early bird get the worm, man. Breakfast club. Good morning, good morning. You up, young fella? You up? What's up, coach? What we want to instill in these guys is purpose over dreams. You follow your purpose, your dream come with it. You know, it's kind of like the Bible. Uh, seek ye first the kingdom which is purpose, and his righteousness, which is right standing and right work. And all of these things will be added, which is dream. So purpose over dream, it's all about your purpose. Man, let's go, man. Unless y'all want to be running this morning on, on Breakfast Club, y'all about to get going. We got six days for a game, so we, we, if it ain't fit hurt, do what you need to do something. All right, so good right now. All right let's keep it good. <laughs> hey, let's go. Bring it in. Bring it in. Bring it in. Hey, good morning, good morning. Hey guys, we're right back to our same schedule. Y'all already know what time it is. All right, let's come in here and work. Let's get it done. When we play less than, let's be six days down. So come in here and lock in on what you need to do. Pick the energy up. All right, who do not want to work out this morning? All right, because it don't matter anyway. <laughs> come on in, bring it in, man. Hey, man, wake up, guys. Wake up. Energy, for real. Hey, brother on three, hood on six. One, two, three. Brother. Four, five, six. Hood, baseline, warm up. Good, 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 good. Sense of urgency. You gotta be with a sense of urgency. Come on, head up. You know, we're working. We're creating a, a habit of work that they understand how to work and then uh, just getting them in the gym. You know, we wanna be a gym rat. So like, we start at six o'clock and we're done at 7.45. A lot of these kids are high level division one players and they got aspirations to go to the NBA. And the only formula for that is the work. Two balls, come on, move, pop, pop, come on. Pop, pop, come on. Pop, pop, ball location. Ball location, come on. Harder, harder, move. So when guys come here, uh, we hope that they understand how to work. But if they don't, this is what the Breakfast Club is about. Switch hands, switch hands. Push each other, come on, wake up, come on. That's too slow in exchange. That's too slow in exchange. He going fast, you going slow. Come on, push each other. Training and development, um, my number one thing is to look at a lot of the skills that the kids have and enhance them. And then look at some of their weaknesses and try to work with them on it as well to get them ready for college. Let's go, let's go. One, two, three, attack me. Good. Uh, if you want me to be honest, I don't think there's no other program doing it how we're doing it over here. Uh, we work hard, extremely hard. And with Compass, there's no breaks. It's about reps. It's a game of reps. So. You talk about perfecting a craft, there's a certain amount of reps that you have to take to call yourself a professional or to be elite at that situation. If it was easy, everybody would do it. Drop, come on, good, way to stop, balance. 
Way to stay balanced, Mar. Come on. Hard dribble. See me? See me? Probe it. Uh, uh. Good. Finish that. Good, 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 good. Here we go. Push it out. Push it out. Get that. Up. Good. Back pedal. Get downhill on this. Downhill. Good. Up. Burn it. Good job. Way to cover ground. Way to cover ground. Same thing. Your focus is bad. It's a game of focus. Let's go. Let's get three. Let's get three. Let's get three. One. One thing that we always say is guard your focus. It's a game of focus. And I know it sounds repetitive, and we say this a lot, but you have to be focused the entire time. Come on, Kylan. Hold that follow through. Good job. And we want it every day. Every single day, we want eyes up, guys paying attention. When you train at the level that we train and you practice at the level that we practice at, now it's about when the game start, can you focus? Wow, that's crazy. Max Prep just came out with their rankings preseason. Number one in the nation. It's our boy Kylan Boswell right there in the cover. I've always believed it. It's just so real to kind of see it, actually show it right there on the, on, on the page. And so it's a blessing, man. We just got to work harder, stay humble, stay grounded, keep the circle small, and do it for the right reasons. Well, my family's background with the school is my mom was the founder of Skyline Education, which was founded in the year 2000. It wasn't necessary to be set off as a basketball institute or a juggernaut. The basketball program was just really started five, six years ago. Is this the starting of the paragraph or is this the starting of the paragraph? This is. Okay, so would you start a paragraph out with the word before? And if I graph four, the girls were, read this for me. 1999, I started working on putting a charter, a one charter together. As we moved forward, we added another school and added another school. And today in total, we have nine charters. <laughs> Adrami's gonna t teach the dogs new tricks. Huh? <laughs> I retired a couple of years ago when the basketball program started to get really good because I wanted to work individually with the young kids. The purpose is to make sure that the students are staying academically sound through the entire school year while they're here. I make sure that their quizzes and their study habits are excellent. These guys are going to go to D1 schools that require them to be college ready when they walk in the door. Are you up? In your government class, are you up? Tuesday and Thursday nights, we be, we be doing study hall. <laughs> we be doing study hall at our house, like if you have like some missing assignments or like, you know, if you need help with some homeworks or whatever, like she's willing to help us. <laughs> Mama O, I feel like she's my mom. Cause she's literally here for me every single time I need her. Every single time. And she's willing to do everything. And I love her so much. She, she, she represents my parents out here. I can say she's my parent here. That's why I, like, I have to think about it. Yeah, you do. You have a lot to think about, huh? Mama O bootstrapped this organization from two classrooms to what it is today. And um, she's a very, very, very special person to me. And, and she's the chairman of the board for Sky and Education. But also in her role now that she's retiring, so she's really helping a lot of these high profile athletes set the stage for where they want to go into the next level. Compass Prep for so long has been the underdog and we've been hunting people. And then now to come into this season and now you're being hunted, I think for me it's trying to get our guys to take the mindset that always finding something that we got to prove. Like we, so instead of people hunting us, we really hunting them. Father God, we come to you today. We just thank you, Lord God. Uh, new season, new team. Same us though, we ain't cutting no corners, God. We're gonna work hard, we're gonna be committed, we're gonna let you use us, uh, have us in purpose, Father God. This a, is this a, this a long year, Father God, but help us to be focused and be ready to go day in and day out. Hey, brother on three, hood on six, one, two, three. Brother, four, five, six. Hood. Let's go, boy. Let's get it, man, let's get it. 
Hey, energy from the jump, yo. Energy from the jump. I feel like, I feel like, I feel like. Dylan Andrews with the steal. Breaks out ahead of the pack. An easy compass with the early lead. Andrews for three. The UCLA guard starting out red hot here in the home opener. Our first game together, we were just excited and we had so much energy. We played as one. That's one thing I can say for sure. Like we had lobs going up in the air to AD and move. Andrews down the lane, the oop to AD. And the Dragons are flying high. So when you look at this year's team at AZ Compass Prep compared to what we saw last year, it is a full orchestra rather than a solo, right? And, and again, that's not dis disrespecting the players that played at Compass. That wasn't named Ty Ty Washington. But this year's team has so many pieces to it where, you know, Dylan Andrews is a guy that's going to UCLA. If you have a point guard that's going to UCLA, you're like, oh man, that, that must be the guy. Oh man, the car from Gardena's put it on the show. Dia came from a spot where he was a man where every play was on his shoulders. And, you know, for us is when these kids come here, we're pretty much a mirror image of the high major division one program because you're going to play with other good players. And you got to find one or two things that you're really, really great at, and you got to contribute that to the team. And, uh, and I think DA's been very solid for a great on ball defender. Uh, he's still putting up shots right now. He's leading score on our team. He's getting the same thing that he's been getting at his old school, but I think structurally and playing with other elite players, I think uh, it's the reason why he came here to be ready for UCLA. got the same vision and the vision is to make these kids pro ready so when you're pro ready that means you're ready to go day one to a school like UCLA and contribute. Dylan Andrews who's a UCLA commit coming in from Southern California they've got just so many dudes now that can be the guy that makes a play at the end of the game that's a game winner or you know hits a game winning shot or makes a big pass I mean they've got so many dynamic guys Mason to the rack for the two-handed slam. And that will do it for AZ Compass as they remain undefeated, improving to 4-0. The number one team in America is living up to the hype. I think as an organization, we're never satisfied. We have the opportunity to do things better and improve. And so those are the conversations that we have as a team. A lot of the discussion early on with students is, what is your purpose in being here, and how can we help you get where you need to go? And so a lot of that conversation with Chance was centered around exactly that. Like, you know, obviously the number one thing, like your dad was saying, is to win Geico. Like, you're, you, you know, you're good enough to stay where you're at and go to college, but you're coming here to win Geico. But at the end of the day, like, we're going to get you ready. Mm -hmm. So wherever school you decide to go to, you're ready from day one, you know what I'm saying? That's why you're here. Appreciate that. So. Oh, that's me, sir. Yes, sir. Let me see you again, bro. Yes, sir. I think the, the mantra of our school, an unwavering belief that all students can succeed. That really is the mantra of AZ Compass. That's the mantra of Sky and Education. Our objective is to do just that, ensure that every student that we come in contact with, we put our best foot forward in helping them to succeed. My name is Chance Westry. I am from Harrisburg, Pennsylvania. By me signing myself to the program, that meant a lot. Cause, like, getting back home, making so many distractions, you can just be going out with your friends and just doing other stuff. But instead, I let myself be locked in and not let distractions get to us. Come on, let's go! Come on, Chance! Pick it up, Chance! There we go, we good, we good! I came to AZ Combos just to be ready for the next level and being able to take criticism. Oh, over the top, over the top! But, but I didn't hear it either, and I'm standing right here. Come on, let's get it right. Hold, 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 hold. My first practice, as soon as I hopped in the drills, we just were competing. Just woke me up like, damn, every day we competing with each other. Hey! 
I'm back. I like that. I can't even like, make nothing up. It's fun as hell. Switch, switch, switch. Chance, the ball over there, you should be up the line and off the ball. You shouldn't even get hit by the flare. How, 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 how? Come on, Josh, come on, Josh, come on, Josh. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. All you gotta do is here, even if you jump straight up, you're gonna block his shot. By having Coach Ed, he sees what we don't even see in ourselves at times. And by him seeing that, you just gotta be like, damn, he getting on you, but you have to listen to what he's saying. Of course he's gonna get on you on the court, you're gonna run, he's gonna push you. He's more than a coach to me, you feel me? He teaches you about life. This was a quote of the day. It say, the reason most people fail, because they give up what they want most for what they want now. Some of y'all want to be at the crib. Some of y'all want to be out of practice. Right now, you throwing away what you really want most. Every time you take a day off, you take a second off, you take a minute off, you're throwing away your future. He's our coach, and he doesn't even play. And the energy he brings, it's like, yo, like, damn, it seems like he on the court. So that just, it's just all contagious, and it carries on along with all of us, and it's just so fun. Be loud. Be loud. All right, put on three, hold on six. One, two, three. Brother. One, five, six. Uh, let's, let's go. go. Hey, you know exactly what he's doing, man. Hey, hey, man, I appreciate y'all again yes, for trusting us, bro. Yeah, I and I promise you, you ain't got to worry about it. He going to be all right. And he fit right in. You can tell, like, oh, the kids love him. they love him, bro. Yeah, like, he love them. Yup, yup, yup. That's awesome. That's awesome. Chance is excited. He's really excited. He's a... We're ready to contribute, and the guys embrace him, and we embrace them. It's a family atmosphere, and we just love it. He loves it, and I'm excited to get going. We want to win the Geico and just do good things here. A lot of good things are going to happen. And the Dragons are number one. AZ Compass, baby, number one in the country. And Andrews a corner three. Knocks it down. AZ Compass with a big lead here in their first grind session lead game. There we go! There we go! We felt in order for Dilling to get ready for UCLA to really continue to sharpen that blade, we needed to make a move because he's in practice more than games. And if he's in practice more than games, he needs to be in a place where he's at an elite level practice. Let's go, y'all. Yeah, Kai. Up, 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 up. Oh, yeah. Green coming. AD, flare. Up, up, up. We're good, we're good. Oh, yeah! <laughs> We've seen Dylan grow tremendously. I've seen his body change. I've seen his effort change. I've seen just how he, his camaraderie with players and um, understanding brotherhood. Um, that's been really, really good. All you're going to do is pop out. Get a catch, get a catch, get a catch. Throw it there. Go around the cone, go around the cone, go around the cone. Can you get a layup? That's my dog. Oh, 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 oh. Just seeing just how they put together a program and really improve Ty Ty's stock. And that was a good selling point for me to see Ty Ty improve, go to Kentucky, and you know, and then to be on the on a draft board. I knew that uh, AZ Compass had a great program. There's a little bit of a high school version of point guard U that's happening at AZ Compass, um, dating back to last year with what we saw with Ty Ty Washington. And, you got a starting point guard that's going to UCLA. Usually that guy's in a slate 32 minutes a game. But now you got Colin Boswell, who's just equally as good at that position. Lamar Washington can play minutes of that. Now they've added another point guard in Chance Westry, who could go to Auburn and be a guy the NBA scouts look at as well. Chance Westry from deep, hits a three. Dragons can't miss. And Compass improves to 5-0 and on the season. I felt like we, we looked okay, man. We played to the level we were supposed to play at. I still feel like, man, we haven't been in a dogfight yet, and we need, to, we need to be in a dogfight. Where you at? Come on, we got to go. 4.30. Oh. You, you already? Yes, I already. Yeah. That's, my, that's, my, that's my boy, Chance. My roommate. What y'all? What you want for? <laughs> <laughs> you, yet? you ate yet? No, it's game day. Uh, I don't actually know how much of a job. I just go up and fill out the game. Mm. It depends how the game goes. You think you think you think you're gonna bang on somebody today? I 
that. You feel it? You feel the chat? Ooh. Hey, we, we'll yeah, talk about this. Feel, that's how you feel, brother, man? Welcome everyone to Chandler, Arizona. The game this early in the season is a true gift to the fans. The number one team in the country, AZ Compass Prep, hosts crosstown rival Dream City Christian, a preseason top 10 ranked team. And Dream City is a rivalry game for us. Big time game, man. And I think it's gonna be different for our guys because they're gonna get to see the different level of intensity. And I think they'll be on the floor with guys that's more comparable to their skill set and, they, and, they, and their talent. Like, they got elite level players, guys that's gonna play in the NBA one day, I think. For this new group, it's gonna have to be, hey man, them recognizing, even though you haven't, you weren't here last year, but understanding the, the severity and like, how tough and how big these games are. Hey, let's go real quick. Hey, this has been a reason why you guys left your high school yes, and came here. Yes, sir. Okay? To win a game yes, like sir. this. Yes, sir. All right? Mm -hmm. Brother on three, hold on six. One, two, three. Hey, brother. Four, five, six. Hey, 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 hey. And we are underway in Chandler. Who's on? Out to Johan Traore. The five-star big man buries the corner three. Traore down the lane, misses, but Sean Phillips is there to clean it up. What an inside presence from Dream City. Compass finds themselves down early. A little adversity for the number one team in America. Now here's Mookie Cook down the lane, raises up, and oh, he is fouled and hits the deck hard, man. Let's hope that he is okay. Mookie got like the ball like on a pick and pop and was able to drive down the lane. I thought he was about to dunk on him, but then he ended up getting fouled. He ended up hitting the ground on his tailbone pretty hard. So we lost uh, Mookie Cook in the first three minutes of the game, which in, in all honesty changed the look of our team. I mean, Mookie is a huge part of what we do. So losing him, it kind of forced us to play smaller. You done. Mookie Cook now heading to the bench and it looks like that will be it for the five-star junior. But that's the type of games we have with Dream City. You got to expect the unexpected. Traore down the lane, hangs and uses the window. What a show so far in front of Kansas head coach Bill Self, no less. Traore has 10 points early on. Back comes Compass. Kylan Boswell pulls up, can't hit. Poor shooting for the Dragons out of the game. Now Milos Uzon rises up. Everything falling for Dream City Christian. A 10-point lead with five minutes to go in the half. Hey, time out, rep. All of y'all are out of character because y'all think y'all done something. You ain't proved nothing. You're not playing hard. You're not moving the ball. You're not doing none of that. And you're not guarding hard. It ain't just right there with Lamar. It's you. It's you. It's you. He got 10. He got like nine points on you. Come on, man. Let's go. Let's go. Hey, brother, I think I'll see one, two, three. Brother. Brother, what's going on right here? Pick it up, bro. You know, or no, you know what, tell Chance, he the flip guy. All right. All right. Compass back in their offensive set. Colin Smith drives down the lane, kicks it out to Chance Westry. And the kid from PA knocks down a much needed corner three for AZ. Hey, you got a guard. Come on, DA. Pick up the screen. Switch it. Get back, Lamar. Keep open up, Lamar. Come on, Chance. Westry now with the steal. Races ahead. Oh, Westry with the emphatic one hand jam. He has been the lone bright spot for Compass so far. Nice ball movement from Compass. Again, they find Westry. And again, he buries it from downtown. Westry now with 14 first half points. But AZ Compass still finds themselves down at the half. I don't know where your head at. I don't know where yours at. I don't know where yours at. If he don't do what he just did, we And y'all out there, mm -hmm. and we not the only ones saying, you got to talk about this text, we literally all cap. Tell their asses they're getting bullied. That's it. That's it. Oh. When y'all turn it up, look what the game did. Y'all was in within four points. Real quick. All you got to do is play hard, compete, discipline. Make the rotations. Talk on defense. None of y'all hitting threes. None of y'all. Hey, li listen to me. Listen to me, fellas. Look and look at me in my eyes. 
You win this game stop by stop. That's it. Offense going to do what it do. But I tell you this, our defense dictate our offense. Right. If you bring it on the defensive end, fellas, when you bring it on the defensive end, this game about to change. Father God, no matter what's going on, Father God, help them to move past it. Help them to play through it, Lord God. Give them confidence. Give them faith, Father God. Help them to believe in his abilities, Father God. Don't let nothing get them off focus, Father God. No matter what it is, who it is, Father God, give them peace in his mind. Help them to play with peace. Help them to play with joy. Help them to find love when he's out here on this court. In your name, amen. Amen. Love you, boy. Come on, come on, come on, Kyle. Looking again for Dream City. This time, Boswell's there to deny the pass. Good job, Bill! Small, Colin Smith gets it. Finds Dylan Andrews wide open. And he sticks the three for Memphis. Nice start out of the great year for the Dragons. Uh, we didn't expect the game to be that close, uh, especially with this year's team. Uh, but when Mookie Cook went down, uh, when he went down, we had to adjust. We played Colin Smith a lot at the five position. The AD was in foul trouble. But talk about, you know, us being resilient. Dream City again in the lane. Sean Phillips rises up, blocked by Colin Smith from behind. Defense really picking up here for Compass. Off the miss, loose ball. Colin Smith tipped it ahead to himself. He'll take off and slam it home. Defense leading to offense is the story of the second half for Compass. So we just had to come together, get stop by stop, and just build, build our way back into it. Street side, dishes it off to Adrami for the jam. Come on, man. I just had to step up. Um, I'm not going to say I'm cocky, but I'm good at pick and roll. So just like me seeing the defense, like seeing the bigs come out and just using AD and me having the space to create and do what I do best. The sixth assist for Westry. Took me, took me to a special place in that game to end up with 27 points. Now for Westry, defense gets tangled and it goes in for his 27th point of the game. And we're all tied up here with less than 90 seconds to go. Pick and roll again from Compass. Oh no, Adrame is called for the offensive foul. No way. And that'll do it for the big man as he fouls out. Dream City right away taking advantage inside and they now hold the lead. Big turn of events here down the stretch. It was a hard fall game. When they got the ball with 18 seconds, we called a timeout and we told our guys, if we get this stop, we're winning this ball game. Listen up, listen up, listen up. We're good. If you got the big fella in the game, we gotta foul him. Yes. Not intentional. How many you got? I barely got it. Yeah. Let me do the foul. Hey, let me have a chance to do it. So we gotta get a stop right here. Try to, hey, try to get a denial and get a quick foul. Hey, hey, bam, bam. The goal was to force him to the sideline, which we did. And Boswell did a tremendous job, and he's one of the best on-ball defenders in the country. And he falls down. Oh, traveling is called. It's a turnover. And Compass all of a sudden has a chance. Down two points with 14 seconds remaining. Have a seat. Bam. You hear? I mean, uh, Makai, you gonna come set it for Colin. All right, when you set it right here, I want you coming up. Bam. If he come off and he behind, if he sit back there, you gotta take this shot. But if not, if he get out there, pull him. Oh, we know three. One, One, two, three, two, three, win. He started off, man, the game pretty rough, missing shots that I know he normally make. But defensively, he was locked in the whole game. That's so when we got the ball back. I usually always go for the win. I usually don't go for the tie. It's just not me. Uh, and we were at home too, and I knew right off back like, hey man, like if, if any if anybody can make a, a deep three uh, off the bounce, it's Kylan Boswell. So the number one ranking is at stake. AZ Compass down two points on their home floor with only 14 seconds. We'll see if they go for the tie or for the win. Boswell now brings it up. Smith with the screen. Dream City switches. Boswell likes his matchup. He'll pull up for three. Yes! AZ Compass wins it at the buzzer. 69 to 68. Kylan Boswell with ice in his.
space. Bam, that's a shot he practiced every day. He put the work in every day, so when he shot it, we already knew what was going to happen. It tells a lot about his character, his perseverance, not having a big time scoring game, not having a, the game that I think he knows he can have on this stage. And to come back in the last seconds of the game to make a big time three, they tell you everything about the kid. He's tough, hard nosed. Uh, He's from Champaign, Illinois, man. What you expect? Great job today. Hey, fellas, Pete kept saying this year going to be epic. That's epic move for number one right there. Win it on the game. Hi, 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 hi. Thank you for watching Purpose Over Dreams. Please click the video box above to watch the next episode. And click subscribe in the bottom right corner for all the new content this season.